In these problems, we are interpreting pie charts. And pie charts are things like this, circles with the wedges cut in them like pieces of pie. Uh, this one says, the pie chart below shows the annual budget for the heavy equipment company. Um, and it's divided by a, a department, so the research department, the engineering. So the bigger the piece of pie, the more money of the budget goes to those different parts of the company. It says, use this chart to answer the questions below. Let's look at these questions. A says, which department accounts for approximately one-fourth of the annual budget? So how am I going to know which one means one-fourth? Well, you know, if you think about a circle, if you cut it into four pieces, you'd get shapes like that, and there would be a 90-degree angle uh, at the, the center angle. So I'm going to look for the piece that looks the most like a 90-degree angle. And to me, that's this one right here inside support. Might be a little shy of 90 degrees, but it's pretty close. So this one should be support. All right, let's look at B. Approximately what percentage of the annual budget is used for support and media combined? Uh, write your answer as a multiple of 10%. So here's support, and you know we said that's about one fourth. So this is about 25%. Um, and here's media, and it looks pretty small. I'm going to guess that's about 5%. And if you added these together and just did it like that, you'd get something that looked like about a third of the pie. So since they want a multiple of 10, I'm going to say that's 30%. All right, let's look at C. C says, if 16% of the annual budget is used for engineering, approximately what percentage is used for research? OK, let's look at engineering and research. So here's engineering, and they're saying that's 16%. And there's research, this big one. To me, that looks about double the size. So I would just multiply that by 2 and say 32%. So that's a little bit of work with interpreting pie charts.